Good afternoon, I'm Kim Baez. A former Los Alamos National Laboratory scientist and his wife, who also worked at LANL, are charged with 22 espionage-related counts. They're accused of handing over classified information about nuclear weapons to an FBI agent who they thought was an operative from Venezuela. News 13's Crystal Gutierrez is live downtown where the U.S. Attorney General just made the official announcement about an hour ago. And Kim, the U.S. Attorney's Office laid out all the evidence against the former scientist and his wife in this 28-page report. Now, the FBI says 75-year-old Pedro Leonardo Mascaroni compiled information about nuclear weapons, put the data on a disk, and delivered it to a man he thought was working for the Venezuelan government, but he was really an undercover agent for the U.S. Now, according to the indictment filed yesterday, Mascaroni started talking with the agent in March 2008. Now, the two met up several times, talking on the phone and exchanged emails. The FBI also raided his Los Alamos house last year. That's where more evidence was gathered, and the FBI says it will now use that against him. The indictment says Mascaroni asked for nearly $800,000 in Venezuelan citizenship in exchange for the classified information. Now, agents say his wife, 67-year-old Margie Rogsby Mascaroni, edited all the documents for him. Mascaroni promised the agent that Venezuela would be able to develop nuclear weapons in 10 years with an underground reactor. The charges against the Mascaronis are very serious. They are the result of a long-term cooperative investigative effort. And according to the indictment, Mascaroni said the reason he was doing this was for the money and his hatred for the Department of Energy and because he thinks smaller countries need to make need to have nukes to keep the U.S. in check. Now, he said he also liked what Venezuelan President Hugo Chavez stands for. Chavez has been an outspoken critic of the U.S. Kim, back to you. Thank you very much, Crystal. Now, the indictment says Mascaroni classified himself and the Department of Energy as enemies. He worked for Lanel from 1979 to 1988. His wife worked up there, up there until this year.